Hi, my name's Juliette and today I'm talking about composition mode in Scrivener 3 for Windows. What? I hear you say. I'm not already in composition mode. Well, yes, in all but name. But what if you could have a typing screen with no distractions? Sort of. This one flips back and forth a bit. I hope you don't get seasick. But everything I needed to change was in a different place. First, go into the view menu and select composition mode. And you get this weird screen with your editing page in the centre and a view of your computer screen in the background. Not exactly distraction free and if I'm honest, quite ugly. But you can change this. So to blank out the background, use the slider on the right. I don't think this colour theme works that well in this mode. To change the background, exit composition mode by pressing escape and under file go into the options panel, appearance and composition mode. There are a ton of colour changing options, not just background, but be aware that if you go back in afterwards and want to change back to default, it may not give you what you expect. I got some dark blue background colour, which I guess is the default for the basic application and not for the theme I've selected. At least that background is less sickly looking. Another option is to have a picture background, something inspirational perhaps. Exiting again. This you can do by going into Project, Project Settings and under Background Images, in the Composition Mode Backdrop section, add an image from your desktop. Does anyone else ever feel that Scrivener is a maze of you'll never find that prize? That effect is a bit like a screensaver. So, what are the other options? Because distraction free doesn't mean you don't have any menus to do things. Does anyone else find that odd? As you can see, you can change where the typing page is positioned, size of text, width, and if you hold down the Alt key, some of these options change. All these are sensible formatting things to have in this view. You also have the ability to open the inspector into a window, go to, the styles box, change keywords. The inspector and go to, OK, you might need to have access to your plot details and other parts of your manuscript. But formatting and keywording is not composition. It is taking you away from composition. Plus, you can use a ton of other functions if you know the key commands, or you use the right click, or there are probably other ways. I don't think I'll be using this view, mainly because I don't like the look of it, and if I'm going to have some functionality, I'd rather have it all. How about you? Do you think you'll be using this view, or will you stick to the standard editor? Thanks for watching, and if you've subscribed, I'll see you again next time.